welcome to the podcast with Face, Pat, and Tiz. Since we brought it up, I, so, and it's shooting involved, the baby. The, the baby. Anybody um, else? No, uh, well, he practiced his Second Amendment and defended his home from a trespasser. And he shot the man in the leg. Um, he, Did you hear the call? He's getting better. Yeah, it was it was a recording of it in the background. And the dude was screaming in, in the background <laughs> that he needs help. And the baby called. He called the police and just had him in the background, you know, that out there. But he he was proud that he didn't take a man's life. They could hear that nothing else was happening to him. Mm -hmm. So the dude could be like, "Oh," and and then he tortured me afterward. No, nigga. Mm -hmm. The baby says to the trespasser, "Heal, heal up and live, my boy. Just don't bring your ass back." I mean that shit. I mean that shit. Cause I'm sick of folk fucking with folk. Just cause somebody rich don't mean them that you supposed to go take their shit. You want to get rich, find a way to do it yourself, or get content with not being rich. But I'm sick of folk just running up on man. You run up in somebody's crib, man. You deserve to get your ass smoked. And, and you're, then, lucky, you're lucky you ran into baby crib because you're running this one. It ain't gonna be no heal up, my boy. It's gonna be R.I.P. My boy, and nobody you, else you better come up in here. See, this the thing when it comes to taking other people's shit. You take that risk of trying to take somebody else's shit and them taking something from you. That something is your life. Because they don't want your valuables. They just want to keep their own. But if you come at somebody with force trying to take their shit, a lot of times nowadays, you're going to end up taking a hot one. Bye-bye. Is it worth it? Is it worth it, man? Get your own shit. Yeah, damn. And then, and then is, is he lucky that the baby was feeling that way that day? Because... Usually the baby is like you did. Um, I'm I'm saying to myself, have you not checked his track record? 2018, the baby shot a man in Walmart in self-defense. He died soon after. 2019, the baby beats up North Carolina rapper who was allegedly mocking him in the mall. 2020, during the pandemic, allegedly beat up and robbed a promoter that owed him $10,000. In the words of Project Pat, how the fuck the robbers going to rob the robbers? In the words of Project Pat, <laughs> I need to realize when you're talking about the baby that Mr. Don't Play. Mm-hmm. He gonna fuck your ass up. Like he done, he done proved time and time again that he is about what he say. Like he, ain't, he is about all of that shit. 2020, the baby slapped a fan, Will Smith, a fan at a show but having their phone too close to his face, he later he later apologized, like Will Smith. Um, 2022, uh, my- this year, he fights Danny Lay's brother Brandon in the bowling alley. And knocked him all the way down the lane. Strike! While they were recording a reality TV show. Like, do your research with people. Like, I mean, like, him, there is people in this world that is just waiting. I'm going to tell you something. For man. you. <laughs> and this is something ain't nobody. Two of them right here. This ain't nothing that nobody ever said, I don't think. I ain't heard nobody say it, but this is a tears take here. Don't try nobody. And I mean nobody. That kill a nigga and go on Vlad and talk about it and still be free. After that, don't mm-hmm. fuck nobody that get away with that shit. I don't know nobody else that got a body that went on Vlad and then they still free afterwards. Everybody done got smoked or, or they gone after Vlad. That nigga still walk around. When you see a nigga like that, that's a that's a super nigga. That he is knows a, the law. Baby is a super nigga. He knows the law. <laughs> he is Thank the future. Bro. That nigga is the T one thousand of goddamn. <laughs> <laughs> he just the baby. Like, Wait till he the team. Wait till he the man. The baby is a goddamn super nigga. <laughs> like you straight up. You can get away with it. Tell you. you got them yes, lawyers straight, man. You got, I, I, you got I, I them lawyers. Like him, yo. Like, 
I can't say nothing philanthropic he done because I don't know it. But I will say when it comes to smacking, punching, kicking, or shooting the motherfucker, he would he'll do it. So don't run up on him trying to act like you about to test him. No, it ain't no test. The only test is gonna be if you got the quicker draw, because that nigga is undefeated right now. He he ain't took a L publicly yet. Man, if somebody come out the woodwork with some footage that we ain't never seen, I'm waiting. Cause we about four, five years in the game, and that nigga still bopping on Broadway on y'all niggas after he shoot niggas. I love that song, man. They got the um the Jabberwockies dancing in the, in the at the end of the video too. I'm always down. <laughs> VA always find their way in every every piece of music, somehow, <laughs> somewhere. Nigga said, I, need, I need me a box with a Glock in it. And if a trespasser come up in the spot, then know I'm a pop in his eye. <laughs> he mean that shit. I believe him. He I pop. believe him. He, he, he is bop your Broadway. He got he he strapped up and he's lawyered up. He got to be lawyered up to, he, to have all that going no, this on nigga and is, has a, a, a prominent career. Man, fuck. <sighs> Got it. This nigga is the Teflon. This nigga is out here popping niggas and beating cases and getting like this nigga is untouchable. He is undefeated. Is, it is nobody else in the rap game that is undefeated. Like ain't that's nobody roll out. Ain't nobody <laughs> rap beef with this nigga. You don't hear nobody dropping no subliminal verses about this nigga. Like this nigga is undefeated, yo. <laughs> like no matter who he this nigga, no. this nigga, this nigga beat the gays. Yeah, he did. This he nigga did. is the Chappelle of hip hop. Like he is uncancelable. Like he can do what the fuck he want to do, and he gonna be right here. <laughs> I need me some shit with some bop in it. <laughs> the thing is, the reason why he's un he's uncancelable because he's been the same baby. He been the the baby, the same person this whole time. <laughs> Nothing nice. about him is out of brand. Nothing yeah. about him. And he has good lawyers. You know who else got good lawyers? 